What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how you can boost your computer's performance and reduce your computer's latency with this FPS boost tool. Now this FPS boost tool provides a lot to boost your computer's performance and it even says what it does, which I'll be showing you guys later in this video. But uh, I do want you guys to keep in mind that this does not work for every computer and it will vary from computer to computer, meaning that it'll be different for all of you guys. So some of you guys it might not work for and if that turns out to be the case, that's going to be the reason why I show you guys how to create a restart point in the beginning of the video because it, you can use it to go back to before you used it in case it does anything to your computer, reduces your performance or anything, you can just go back like that. But uh, yeah, and also want you guys to know that I am really appreciated of your guys' support. I got to 1k because of you guys, I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you guys, so I'm really grateful for you guys. And uh, if you guys would like to support me even further, make sure you go to the item shop and then put my supported credit code scythe in the supported credit code in the item shop if you guys want to support me i would be highly appreciated i would highly appreciate you guys if you guys did this but yeah let's get straight into the video all right guys so guys what you want to do is go to the link down below that i will be putting in the description it will take you to this discord server now once you are in this discord server you want to go to where it says important scroll up and you will see where it says buy it now now what i do want to say to you guys is that the program is 25 dollars but if you guys use my code scythe which is going to be on the screen you guys get 20 percent off if you guys decide to buy the program which i highly recommend because i've tried it myself and this program actually works you get a boost in fps and your latency is decreased heavily the benchmarks to this program and all games are impressive it is way beyond anything you guys can use so i highly recommend this, especially if you're on low end pc and if you do decide to buy it just click on the link uh, you want to sign up, but once you sign up, make sure to use my code as I put in the screen before, just Scythe. And then once you guys done that, just click up here where it says account. And if you guys bought it, it would say status. You have Bob VTRL, just press download right here. Now, once you guys have it download, just go to your start menu right here. And then where it says VTRL, the program you just installed, just open it. See, I already have it open, so I don't need to. But basically, once you open it, you will be greeted with this. Now, what you guys should do is go to your search bar and type in create a restart point. You want to press create and name it anything and press create. Now, the reason why I'm telling you guys this is because if anything goes wrong on your computer and it actually makes your performance worse, which it shouldn't, you can always go back to your restart point that you just made. So that's why I'm encouraging you guys to do this before you do anything on your computer. Now, once you guys have done that, you want to go to where it shows the little wrench up here. And basically, you want to click Run VTRL Auto Tuner. Now, this will give you the best tweaks on your computer, basically, with this program. And also, not only that, you also get more tweaks right here, such as main tweaks and all of these tweaks right here. Now, what I recommend for this, though, is to just read all of these and see what it does, and then enable it, and then try it out. And I'm, I'm sure that most of these actually work. But, you know, tweaks like this, like, you know, this. But you also have to read it because if you have one of these, then you shouldn't use it. It even tells you right here. Yeah, but you see, most of these actually work, such as this, latency tolerance. It explains what it does here. And just stuff like that. So just go through all of these, read it, see what it does, and then enable it and try it out and I'm telling you this will help your computer a ton I tried it myself and I was I was impressed my FPS got boosted tremendously now over here we got more stuff such as cleaning scripts and all of that you can empty your recycle bin you could reset your internet cleaner all of that which I don't think you guys should be touching but maybe touch some of these if you know what you're doing you know you don't want to disable Wi-Fi you need that um, you, you can disable Bluetooth if you're not using it. Remove game bar. Windows Defender only if you're not using it. You know, clipboard, nobody really uses that. Printing, I don't think anyone uses that. Um, you can also remove Windows Auto Update, which I feel like a lot of you guys might have that might be affecting your performance. So I recommend, you know, putting that one over anything and also Cortana too and Xbox services because those are not needed either now you also got game configurations now what you guys can do scroll down look for your game 
if you can't find your game which you should um it's all right i this program is kind of in beta at the moment it's still getting updates but at the moment there is four games uh most of you will be playing fortnite so you just click here you press performance or competitive and you press apply and it'll basically put your fortnite settings onto the best ones that you clicked so like if it's competitive basically it'll just give you the best competitive settings if it's performance it'll give you the best performance settings i'm pretty sure you guys get that but yeah that's basically it for that um you can also do stuff like drive cleaning all three of these i feel like these are like more optional but i mean you guys can try them if you want all it would do is just boost your performance even more you guys might have stuff in your recycle bin so you guys can just click it once and wait for it to load it'll it'll probably take a bit to load as you see it just re uh, emptied my recycle bin i clicked it twice but as you've seen, it just emptied it out. Uh, sometimes you guys might have deleted stuff and you never went to your recycle bin and actually emptied it out. And you might have a lot of stuff that's taking up your storage, which can actually take up your performance in games. Because if you don't have a lot of space in your drive, your drive is not going to work well in games. So that is very important to actually use. And drive clean, just click it, wait for it to load. So yeah, that's what it basically does. It, it basically just cleans your drive like that. Now, it's gonna close like it did for me because all it's doing is just cleaning out unnecessary files in your drive. That's basically what it does. But right after that, what you guys wanna do is basically just restart your computer. And after you restart your computer, the tweaks should be applied and all of that and your games will feel a lot better. All right guys, that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell to get notified whenever I post out more tweaks. Also, make sure you guys use my supporter creator code Scythe and item shop, please consider using it. Uh, I would highly appreciate it. And uh, yeah, see you guys in the next video, peace.